Hey everybody, this is Brian, b, &B Homesteading again. I wanted to show you the change that we made to the uh, salad bar LED area. Let me grab the camera and I'll take you over. So this used to be charred central, and now it's kale central. And I think this is gonna do really well in here. So basically these are the kales that are staying in. This is the new one. These are both Vates kale. They're really nice, they're tender, they're great in salads. I mean, we eat this all the time. At least once a week we're having a salad out of this kale. Probably twice a week, because I usually come down and I harvest and I get enough for where we get two meals out of this kale for a dinner salad to go with our meals each week. Along with Paula's uh, amazing dressings she makes with our kefir. But uh, yeah, I mean, this is, the, this is the first day they're in here, so I just swapped these in. So in another hour or two, the lights are going to come on and they're going to start getting their daily dose of light from the, uh, the True Daylighter Rolado LED lights. And uh, I think they'll be really happy in here because it's going to be a little cooler because they're not inside of a tent. And I folded up the, uh, the plastic. I don't put that down over anymore because the air time temperature underneath here in the underneath of our house is staying right around 70 degrees with the other grow tents. And it's, you know, an insulated uh, storage area. So it doesn't really cool off under here anymore like it used to. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be great having these uh, kale right here for us to harvest. So that's kind of the update for the salad bar LED area. All right, it's been Brian from p and Homesteading. Hope you guys had a great weekend. It's gonna be a really great week here. We're talking about, uh, I guess the forecast, maybe even getting into the 80s. So it's gonna be pretty nice here in the uh, Portland metro area. All right, talk to you guys again, bye.